Hey everyone, welcome into Mountain Dog Companion. Thanks for tuning in again. Uh, hanging out with Angie, Sharon, and Boomers later. Um, and talking today about what we, or why we enjoy what we do. So I'll let Angie get into it first. So Jay, these little ones are four weeks old. Mm -hmm. Yesterday, right? Yesterday. And um, they have completed their sound training. So first of all, completed their neurological and their sense. Um, they have completed their sound training last week. So this week we start on mobility. So we have um, some examples here of things that get put out for them to interact with. It's a climb over, um, working on strength. So we get to see them start moving around. Oh yeah. Mama stands now to feed. So pups will have to use these back legs um, like this, you know, to nurse. So it just strengthens this back core for them. Um, we just continue on in our, like week four is really about mobility, um, getting them to start interact with things, um, showing interest in toys, and then we also have a bunch of toys that make movement, so kind of reinforces, reinforces the sound that we introduced last week, but then with movement. For sure. And this is Miss Sadie, this is the remaining pup from Cleo's Literal, Cleo and Firestone, she's nine weeks old. So you can see four weeks to nine weeks. Nope, there you go. Obvious difference in movement, right? Oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> she just snagged her toy, now she's out. Yeah. She's no, this is one of my favorite stages. Like it's it's so fun to see. And guys, like if, if you like, if you had the opportunity to do this, like, it, or if you do have it, I mean, this part is just absolutely phenomenal. That's why we are blessed, aren't we? We get to yeah. play with puppies every day. Exactly. More than just play them. We oh, get yeah, to play, it's a lot we of get to snuggle, but we actually get to imprint them mm -hmm. with certain things in their development process that just makes them have a very strong foundation. For sure. So. Yeah, you can see definitely more. The difference between last week and this week is like amazing. <laughs> <laughs> Sadie, just take it easy out there. Really enjoying being the only child. Oh, you yeah. <laughs> yeah, gets all the attention. Everything's all the hers. Love. <laughs> Everything's um, hers. But no, they're just starting to move, move around. Like last week, we had them up here on the on the couch and just hanging out. And right now, I mean, if we had them on the couch, they'd be jumping or falling off probably right. or moving around too much. But even so. the little um, little legs are going and the tails are going. <laughs> yeah. Some are a little more active right now. We actually gave them a little bit of a bath this morning. That's why some of them look a little bit, mm -hmm. little bit moist. What do you think is is my favorite part of this? What is your <laughs> favorite part? <laughs> I don't know if I ever. Well, yeah, no, we ever talked about that. You never told me. No. Yeah. I, it's honestly the. Um, fulfilling part of helping a family find their, yeah. you know, I, their I was, pup. I was about to say that, but yeah. I was going through the development process thinking, is it playing with the yeah. puppies? I mean, that too. It's finding the joy oh, yeah. and knowing that you yeah. found a companion for them that's part of their family. If everything goes well. You're right, now, obviously. If, you know, of yeah. course, there's things that come up and right. sometimes it's just not as smooth as, as, smooth as it could yeah. be, but. Well, they're animals, um, right? Yeah. And so. they require a lot of time and attention. Mm -hmm. And a lot of time and attention at this stage. Oh, for sure. Yeah. <laughs> so, I usually tell people you really need to get through the first two years. <laughs> the second year is like just a light switch. All of a sudden, it's just wonderful. Mm -hmm. It's wonderful. What's your favorite part? My favorite part of the whole process? Yeah. Um, Probably not saying goodbye. No. You know, <laughs> the bye, goodbye to me when the placement is Ooh. right is bittersweet. Yeah. <laughs> Um, yeah. But really, one of my favorite parts is the birthing. Really? It is. I love, I love to raise puppies alongside of my moms. Oh, they need my help, right? Mm -hmm. These little ones, well, they could survive without me. <laughs> yeah. But I Probably love to be easy. able to imprint them and introduce at the right times. And I don't know, every stage I have, like at this stage, once they start to go home, then I breathe a little bit and I think, like reflect on the litter. I love every stage of it. Oh yeah. Yeah, and then this stage is super fun. Oh, this stage easy, is fun, easy. yeah. Eight to nine yeah. weeks, eight to 10 weeks is where they really start to uh, need a little more structure. <laughs> mm -hmm. 
And they're asking for it, actually. And so we do always. a lot of playtime. We do a lot of mental work. Mm -hmm. um, if they're still with me, I like to start on their basic commands. And no! Whatever. <laughs> <laughs> Just, you're something else. She actually was Jay's pick out of the whole day. Oh, yeah. Remember that on the front yeah. porch? On one of the first yeah, videos. Yeah, he's like, he she's did. my favorite one. Yeah. <laughs> she's at the largest, too. She pulled out. She wasn't the largest for the first like week three to five, mm -hmm. but she pulled up and she's close to 10 pounds. So the dad of these puppies, Boomer, mm -hmm. um, he's what, how big, I forget. Around 16. 16. Yeah, so he's a little And then Boomer's small. closer to 20 pounds. Ah! Firestone's closer Earth. to 20, yeah. Oh, yeah. right, yeah. 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 yeah, yeah. That's what yeah. I meant. I so, yeah. I, that's why we're gonna help when each I mean, other, right? I say, <laughs> yeah. um, <laughs> But no, that's, so the, these guys will be a little bit smaller uh -huh. um, overall comparing to that litter. Um, but yeah, they're doing great, coming along very well. We got these bumper toys, I don't know if you saw that, um, helping with different textures, uh, different spots if they step on it, it's just a mobility thing. Um, and then, yeah, Andy talked a little bit about the noise and movement toys, which is phenomenal. Uh, Miss Sadie knows all about them. She's been through everything. <laughs> These guys are just learning more about it. Doing very well with it. Um, but yeah. Look at the curl on this letter. Oh, Can it's... you see this? This curl, it's on this forehead. I'll show you guys There's here. a good portion of them that already have that like strong can, curl. Yeah, you can really yeah, see it over the, the top. Back. Yep. Yeah. Helps a little bit that they're... A little bit moist. Yeah. yeah. Yep. But just a great, great litter. Good colorations. Um, traditional mm. points on them, which is good. Yep. <laughs> She's so nice. She's stealing the show today. <laughs> she is. She is. She is. And she's still available. So she anyone available. watching this video, if you guys are interested in learning more about sweet little Sadie hanging out here, the goofball, <laughs> um, let me know. Feel free to, I'll have my contact information here at the end of the video and at the bottom. Um, so yeah, feel free to reach out. But again, guys, these are uh, Sharon and Boomer's puppies. They're at four weeks old going through um, some new stuff this week. So um, if you guys have any questions about any of these puppies, about availability, about our program, or just anything in general regarding uh, Bernie Doodles here, feel free to reach out to me. My name is Jay Miller here at Mountain Dog Companion. My number is 330-234-0102. You can call or text me at, uh, or you can call or text me or email me at mountaindogcompanion at gmail.com. Thanks for tuning in today, guys. We'll see you next week. Um, have a great rest of your week and take care.